morning. I'm Donald Wise, president of the UCD Engineering Graduates Association, and I want to welcome you all to the 2021 EGA Gold Medal and Award Ceremony. I hope you all enjoy this virtual ceremony and see it as both a recognition and a celebration of the academic excellence of our latest group of graduates. We have over 20 awards for which I must thank our sponsors, each of whom will be mentioned as the award they sponsor is presented. I congratulate you all on your achievements. I also congratulate the faculty who have helped you and your classmates to achieve your degrees and your families for the support they have given to you throughout your studies. Not all of the hard work has been yours. I commend the entire class of 2021 graduating in unprecedented circumstances. I know you will add to the richness of the Irish and international engineering community. While this ceremony is one of celebration of achievement, it is also an opportunity to, have a, to issue a challenge to you all. Our global society is facing enormous challenges. It will take the engineering community to find and implement solutions. I'm not just talking about coronavirus or global warming. I'm talking about equality for all people. For true equality, we must find ways to feed the world, to educate all, to overcome disease and illness everywhere, to provide appropriate infrastructure and support for those in need, to use our resources wisely, to protect the planet for future generations. To many, that sounds impossible, and it seems unlikely that we can all get involved. Yet, remember, you are engineers. You can spend the rest of your lives working to solve the smaller problems that together move all of us in the right direction. We are celebrating your excellent academic achievements in UCT today, and we challenge you now to go out into the world and to make a difference in as many ways and for as many people as you can to engineer a better world for us all. I wish you, our winners, and the class of 2021 every success. I hope you will join our EGA and enrich us with your involvement as alumni. Thank you. Hello, my name is Associate Professor Amanda Gibney and I'm the Head of School of the UCD School of Civil Engineering. I'm here today to present the Ronald Donovan Prize on behalf of Seamus McGarrett, Director at Ronald Donovan. This award is presented to the student in the final stage of the Master of Engineering in Civil Engineering, Civil and Environmental Engineering, Structural and Structural Engineering with Architecture, who has the highest mark in their dissertation. This year the Ronald Donovan Prize is awarded to Fionn de Burka for his project entitled Cycling Cost-Benefit Analysis to Identify Best Cycling Links to Make Improvements in the Dublin Cycling Network. Congratulations to Fionn. Hi, my name is Elizabeth Falvey. I'm PM Group's Process Department Manager in Dublin. I'm delighted to present the PM Group Kevin Kelly Design Award 2021 to Jai Chai. Now in its 22nd year, the award is designed to recognize ability, effort and excellence. It is part of our program to encourage the next generation of engineers in Ireland. We're delighted to be part of the annual UCD medal ceremony and we're particularly pleased that Jai was chosen as the 2021 recipient. We wish her every success in the future. Congratulations. Hello, my name is David Hearn, Vice Chairman at Deloitte and proud graduate of UCD School of Engineering. It gives me great pleasure to present the 2021 Deloitte MEM Gold Medal. Deloitte have chosen to sponsor this medal because we believe the MEM is one of the leading postgraduate courses in Ireland and teaches vital skills uh, which are really even more vital in today's uh, COVID and uh, climate challenged world. So without further ado, I'd like to congratulate Damien McGuinness, 
Engineering Manager at Leo Pharma here in Dublin. Congratulations, Damien. Well done. You are the recipient of the 2021 Deloitte MEM Gold Medal. Good morning. I'm Michael Gilchrist, and I have the pleasure today of representing the Institution of Mechanical Engineers at this awards ceremony for UCD engineering graduates. The Institution of Mechanical Engineers is one of the world's oldest professional institutions for mechanical engineers, and we have more than 100,000 professional members worldwide. We were founded in 1847 and our headquarters, which you can see here behind me, are based in London at number one Birdcage Walk, just across the bridge from the Houses of Parliament. Within Ireland, we have very active members and we operate in association with the Mechanical Division of Engineers Ireland. Our work focuses on representing the professional interests of mechanical engineers specifically. Today, we are delighted to recognize the outstanding academic excellence of four of UCD's graduating class of 2021 with the following awards. The best student certificate is awarded to Dhiran Shafri. The best project certificate is awarded to Caroline Crowley and the Institution Project Award is given to Sophie Cassidy. And finally, the Frederick Barnes Waldron Best Student Award is made to Aidan Lee. Thank you very much and congratulations all. My name is Sean Giblin. I am the Global Product Manager for HVAC in ABB. Cylon controls are part of ABB Smart Building Solutions. Cylon Controls was founded 36 years ago as a campus company in UCD, and UCD have been great supporters of Cylon over the years and have used our systems to control the buildings in, on the campus. Cylon's products are sold around the world and they are now sold in more countries by ABB. Our Cylon products deliver well-being, comfort, energy efficiency and operational efficiency in buildings which allow businesses and organisations to have a more sustainable footprint and a more sustainable future. In Cylon, we consider project skills very important for engineers and for their careers and framing how they develop innovative ideas and de deliver results. So I'm delighted today to be able to present the Cylon Award for Excellence in Electrical Engineering to Mohammed Saeed and also I'm delighted to be able to award the Cylon Award for Excellence in Electronic Engineering to Keane O'Donnell. So congratulations to Mohammed and to Keane. And I'd just like to wish everyone a very enjoyable graduation today.
I'm Peter Kennedy, head of the School of Electrical and Electronic Engineering. It's my pleasure to present the James G. Lacey Award for Excellence in the Innovative Application of Electrical Engineering. The award is made possible by a donation from Liam Madden, an alumnus of the school and Executive Vice President at Xylems Corporation in California. The awardee this year is Robert McCarthy for his master's project on the innovative application of model-based artificial intelligence in robot control. Congratulations, Robert. Each year, the School of Chemical and Bioprocess Engineering awards the AbbVie Achievement Award in Chemical and Bioprocess Engineering to the Stage 3 student who has obtained the highest accumulated grades in their specified chemical and bioprocess engineering modules. This year, the joint winners of the AbbVie Achievement Award are Niall Brady and Alexander Timlin. Each year, the School of Chemical and Bioprocess Engineering awards the Pat McAdam Scholarship to a Stage 2 Chemical and Bioprocess Engineering student on the basis of a competitive interview. This year, the winner of the Pat McAdam Scholarship is Bill Fitzgerald. My name is Ashling Judge and I'm a Process Engineering Team Lead at Eli Lilly Kinsale and I'm delighted to be with you all today to present the Masters in Engineering Research Award and um, the inaugural time that Eli Lilly is sponsoring this award. Here at Lilly we value innovation and technical expertise and we're delighted to be able to present this award for the first time to align with our true values of ensuring the ongoing growth and development of the pharmaceutical industry in Ireland and particularly the ongoing growth and development of young graduate engineers. I'm delighted to be here to be able to present the award to Lisa Galvin for her excellent research over the past 12 months. Lisa, many, many congratulations on this award. I hope you get to enjoy it and, spe and celebrate with your friends and your family. And we're very much looking forward to welcoming you here to Kinsale very soon to join us on our graduate programme. All the best. Each year, the School of Chemical and Bioprocess Engineering supports excellence in engineering research by awarding the Carthy Research Project Award to the student who obtains the highest grade in the research project in Stage 4 of the Chemical and Bioprocess Engineering Programme. This year, the winner of the Carthy, Biz uh, the Carthy Research Project Award is Neve O'Connell. Each year, the School of Chemical and Bioprocess Engineering awards the Carthy Business Plan Award to the group of students who obtain the highest grade in the Chemical Engineering Business Plan module. This year, the winners of the Carthy Business Plan Award are Jack Ward, Andrew Tutty and Jack O'Connor. Hello, Joseph. Uh, my name is Fergus Monan from Arab. Um, delighted to present the gold medal for architecture to you uh, this year. Unfortunately, it's virtually, uh, which is perhaps the way you spent most of the last year or so in college. 
uh, which I hope was not too difficult for you, um, um, and you and clearly you've got through it and got through it successfully. So well done on that. On the positive side, unlike previous years when I've presented this medal, you could not be coming into the industry at a better time. Uh, wonderful opportunities out there and I wish you the very best in shaping a better Ireland uh, for us all if indeed you're staying here and, and not travelling. Again, congratulations and the very best for the future. Take care. Morning all, it's Cormac Woods here from RPS Group. I'm a technical director in our buildings and infrastructure sector out in West Pier and Dunleary here. First, I'd like to thank the ECD Engineering Graduates Association for inviting RPS to sponsor the Civil Engineering Medal again this year. This continues our long association with UCD, with many of our key people here being UCD graduates. We've taken part in, in the various mentorship programs over the years, with many of our interns returning to work with us upon graduation. Just to give you a feel for what RPS are, are, have been up to in the last few years in Ireland, we're involved in many flagship projects such as the remediation of the East Tip and Hall Bolan, uh, the restoration of the Shaky Bridge, Daly's Bridge in Cork, uh, the M11 motorway bypassing Enniscorthy, and more recently we're involved, we've been involved in the design of the Broadmeadow Greenway which will run from Malahide Castle out to Dunabate in North County Dublin. So, without any further ado, I'd like to announce the 2021 winner of the Engineering Graduates Association Civil Engineering Medal is Henry Hall. Congratulations, Henry, and a, a big well done and a career landmark. And all the best in your future career in engineering. Thanks very much, everyone. Hi David, uh, my name is Fergus Monaghan, I'm a director with ARB and uh, we've been sponsoring the gold medal for structural engineering with architecture for a number of years. I'm really delighted to virtually present the medal to you this year. It cannot have been an easy year for you and for all your colleagues in college, um, but on the other high end, uh, you could not be coming into the industry at a better time. Please stay in touch with the EGA, it's a really, really wonderful organisation. And I wish you the very best for your career and congratulations again on winning the gold medal. I'm Peter Kennedy, Professor of Microelectronic Engineering and Head of the School of Electrical and Electronic Engineering. It's a pleasure for me to announce the winner of the Dialogue Semiconductor Electronic Engineering Gold Medal. Dialogue Semiconductor is a fabulous semiconductor company that's primarily focused on the development of highly integrated and power efficient mixed signal integrated circuits for consumer electronics and high growth segments of automotive and industrial end markets. Their semiconductor based solutions are offered as standard, configurable and custom products which enable their customers the highest degree of flexibility to differentiate their products and accelerate their time to market. The Dialogue Semiconductor Electronic Engineering Gold Medal is awarded this year to Joseph Carthy for achieving a first class honours with the highest grade point average in the final year of the ME Electronic and Computer Engineering degree programme. Congratulations Joseph. Madeleine Larry. I'm the Director of the Undergraduate and Master's Degree Programmes in Biomedical Engineering here at UCD. I'm delighted to be here today to present the EGA Pagliari Gold Medal in Biomedical Engineering on behalf of John O'Dea, Chairman of Pagliari. Pagliari are a medical device company based in Galway who are dedicated to advancing the state of the art in endoscopic, laparoscopic and robotic surgery. Over the past year they've been working closely with UCD and the Matter Hospital on developing new solutions for infection control within the hospital environment. I'm delighted to announce the winner of today's medal, who is Emma Bailey. Emma is the recipient of the Engineering Graduate Association's Pagliari Gold Medal in Biomedical Engineering for achieving the highest GPA in the ME in Biomedical Engineering. 
Congratulations to Emma and all of her classmates today and thank you to Pagliari for their continued support. Good morning. I'm delighted to join you today by video at the Engineering Graduates Association Gold Medal and Awards Ceremony. And thanks to the President, Donald Wise, for the invitation to participate today. My name is Brian Gilmore. I'm the Communications Manager with Irish Cement, which is part of CRH, the Global Building Materials Group, headquartered in Ireland, but with operations in over 30 countries worldwide. On behalf of all my CRH colleagues, I'd like to congratulate Michael Connolly, this year's winner of the CRH Mechanical Engineering Medal. Well done, Michael. I hope you're very proud of this great achievement. And despite the circumstances we find ourselves in, you get an opportunity to enjoy yourself. Well done to all the other award winners today. It's fantastic to see the tremendous talent there is uh, in the engineering space. And as you move ahead with your careers, you're going to be leaders in this area, hopefully helping to shape the innovations and solutions to the various challenges that we all face. So I wish you all the best for the remainder of the ceremony and in your careers ahead. Thank you very much. Hello everyone. My name is John Hanley and I'm the Managing Director of FTT Consulting Engineers and Project Managers Limited. I'd like to express my gratitude to the EGA and the UCD College of Engineering and Architecture for affording FTT the opportunity to present this year's Biosystems and Food Engineering Award. FTT are an Irish consultancy established in 1991 and we are 30 years in business this year. Over 50 engineers and scientists currently work for FTT and our core team of 30 engineering consultants support our clients across a broad range of industries, including brewing, distilling, pharmaceutical and semiconductors, to name a few. As I speak, FTT engineers are supporting um, processing utility projects across five continents. FTT's cohort of chemical, mechanical and electrical engineers are highly proficient in the areas of process and utilities design, process safety and energy efficient design. This last topic being an area which we are very passionate about. We have hired many graduates from UCD over the company's lifespan. As of August 2021, 13 of our full-time consultancy staff are UCD graduates, and three of our six company directors are UCD alumni. We have a tradition of placing UCD interns each year, and we have taken on two engineering interns per year for the past few years. We pride ourselves on trying to give these young engineers a meaningful and stimulating start to their lives as professional engineers by ensuring they are active members of our consultancy teams for the duration of their time at the company. It gives me great pleasure to announce that the 2021 recipient of the EGA FTT Biosystems and Food Engineering Medal is Andrew McMahon. On behalf of FTT, I'd like to congratulate Andrew, commend him on the great effort he has put in, and I sincerely wish him the best of luck in his future career and endeavours. EGA Gold Medal Ceremony. My name is Professor Eva Ahan, and I am the Dean of Engineering and the College Principal for the College of Engineering and Architecture in University College Dublin. It gives me great pleasure to be able to congratulate this year's award winners on their achievements, in particular after what has been a difficult and unprecedented time in their lives. Unfortunately, their final year in UCD was probably not what they would have expected. But I do hope that we are all now moving to a more normal situation in the future. I congratulate you all on your awards, and I also congratulate your friends and families who have supported you during your studies. I'd also like to take the opportunity to thank our sponsors, 
who have continued to support us in these very difficult times. These awards are very important to our students and their families, and without you, they would not happen. Finally, I wish all our award winners the best of luck as they graduate and ask them to remember UCD and the EGA fondly. Thank you.